Welcome to Revelation Unraveled. I'm your host, William Tapley, also known as the Third Eagle of the Apocalypse and the Co-Prophet of the End Times. As I'm sure uh, many of you know, the Supreme Court usually issues their rulings during the month of June. So we can expect very soon that they will rule that gay marriage is constitutional. And those of you who know Bible prophecy understand that the Antichrist will change time, laws, and seasons. And this shows just how tremendously powerful the Antichrist is in these end times. All throughout the world, many countries, Catholic, Protestant, Christian countries, are accepting gay marriage. And the Supreme Court will eventually follow suit, if not this month, very soon. And of course, the Antichrist will seek to change the most important of God's laws. And the very first law of God in the Bible is that marriage is between one Adam and one Eve. In fact, this law predates the Ten Commandments. And in fact, it even predates the law that there are seven days in one week. Because on the sixth day, God created man, and he created them male and female. Incidentally, I believe the Antichrist will even try to change the second law in Scripture, and that is that there are seven days in a week. And this may not occur until the Antichrist manifests himself publicly. As I have said many times, I believe all four end times entities are here now. The Antichrist, the false prophet, Enoch, and Elijah. And of course, the first of these to manifest himself will be the false prophet, because he will introduce the Antichrist in very much the same way as John the Baptist introduced Jesus Christ. Now, some people say, for example, that our current Pope, Pope Francis, is the false prophet. Some people within the church and without the church. I am not willing to state that at this time because he has not done any of the specific prophecies that the false prophet will do. For example, he has not okayed the mark of the beast. Consequently, Pope Francis could very well be the final good pope, and that is Petrus Romanus. So let me close by saying even though it is very discouraging for the Supreme Court to break the very first law of God, don't forget they have already broken the Ten Commandments by allowing the deliberate killing of an innocent human being, which is what abortion is. In the very end, Jesus will defeat the Antichrist. And don't forget, his primary weapon will be Mary's Rosary, just as David defeated Goliath with five smooth stones. And as always, I do offer a free copy of my book, Revelation Unraveled. I do have some left. I offer these free until I run out. And you can write to the address you see on your screen, or you can go to my channel and you can read my book online. Just click on Revelation Unraveled. It's in the top banner on my channel. <clears throat> or if you want to hear me reading the book, you can click on my William Tapley channel. That's also available on the Third Eagle Books channel. Just click on William Tapley on the upper right. And so far, I have read about 20% of my book, and I hope to finish it all within the next couple of months. In any event, I do recommend that you start praying the rosary, because that is how we can grasp all of these evils which are coming upon the world. That is how... Jesus will defeat the Antichrist.